All right, folks, this is Jason with the Primal Outdoors channel, and we are headed out. Uh, last few weeks, we've been working on the truck after we uh, returned the Kia, and we've gotten the Ford back. We've been spending some time working on some projects, trying to get it lined out for some uh, bigger overland trips that I have planned here in the uh, fall, late fall and early winter. And uh, so anyways, we're back over in Central Oregon, and uh, we're out with the truck right now. And I thought we'd just go out for a couple days, do a little shakedown run, make sure everything's okay because we did some repairs to the truck. We switched out axles on the trailer. Uh, there was uh, some other upgrades and things that we changed. So I figure we'll just go out for a couple days and just see how everything's working, make sure uh, nothing falls apart on us. And uh, hopefully we're, we're ready to go for some overland here very shortly. All right, so it's about three o'clock. I'm gonna go ahead and stop for the day. Uh, being that it's three, it should give me a good uh, three hours or so of daylight left. And I wanna take the opportunity to kind of go through the truck and go through the trailer, making sure that the suspension and everything, all the bolts are still tight and everything's holding up there really well. I also check uh, some of the repairs I made to the truck and make sure everything is good there. So that'll give me plenty of time for that, but it'll also give me plenty of time uh, that I see that there is a fallen tree over here and I uh, can get the chainsaw out and cut up a little firewood for tonight. I guess we're finally gonna get settled in for the evening. Uh, kind of messed around a little bit this afternoon, just getting wood cut and split, and then along with the added time it takes just to film things, uh, I didn't get around to really looking at the trailer or looking at the truck, but I figure I, could, I got plenty of time in the morning. Uh, I can go over everything then and make sure everything's uh, working out, but I'm pretty sure it is. I mean, the tra trailer um, drove really nice today and you know, the truck seemed completely fine. So I'm not really expecting to find anything, but as much as anything, it just kind of gives you a chance to just make sure one, that there's no problems. And two, I've got a couple of other pieces of gear that I've changed out. And I added some propane lines uh, that you might've seen earlier in the video. I added some propane lines to the trailer. So I'm kind of playing with that. and and uh, figuring out some stuff there. And then I've kind of changed out my burners a little bit uh, to work better with the, the quick disconnect. So 
Uh, so all in all, like I said, this is, as much as anything, this trip is a uh, just a good shakedown trip. Uh, make sure everything's working the way I want before you know I get really dedicated and and get out away from uh, you know any major towns where I can get supplies or uh, repair things easily. So, but I'm got my Pendleton. I'm gonna drink, have a couple drinks, and then uh, I'm gonna get some dinner going. I've got a little bit of uh, bear breakfast sausage, uh, some from my bear this year, and I'm gonna mix that with some onions and some other things, and, and just have a simple simple meal on that'll be off the scottle and and then probably uh head in for the night I know all right well we're starting to get up this morning uh, you know it's a it's okay day uh, looks like mostly cloudy it looks like a few more clouds have moved in since uh, just since the Sun started to rise a little bit but uh, it's fairly chilly got a little fire going in the biolite which I'm a little tardy on that review I know some of you are waiting on it and wanting to know my my thoughts on it but uh, we'll definitely be working on that very soon and we'll try to get it out to you guys in the next week or two so that uh, you can hear what I have to say on that but uh, I mean all in all I it's a it's a useful it's a useful uh, little fire pit for me in the way I'm doing things but uh, I'll give you guys some more details on the pros and cons in the review but as it is right now I'm gonna enjoy a little bit of coffee and I want to get some breakfast going here pretty quickly uh, and eat and then eventually just kind of get things all packed up and then once I get things packed up I want to get my high lift jack out and lift the trailer up a little bit and check the wheel bearings make sure that they're all still seated well and make sure all the bolts and everything are tied on the timber and suspension I also want to check the truck so we'll we'll be getting to that here pretty quick after a little coffee oh you guys are good doggies you guys are good doggies. Right, guys so we got camp all pretty well picked up at this point uh, now I've got the high lift jack out and I got this side picked up I'm just gonna start kind of go through some checks on the trailer I'm um, giving the tire a good shake 
Uh, feels pretty good at this point. Um, this one feels all right, but uh, we'll check the other one as we go to the other side. I also want to check all the bolts on the timber and make sure that nothing has come loose or backed off or anything. So we're going to do that right now on this side. So this is the uh, front tire. I lost a bearing on this uh, side, so I replaced this also during the couple weeks uh, after hunting season. Just giving a quick check out, make sure everything's good. Um, everything does seem to be good. It seems to be solid. Um, you know, anybody who doesn't know, like if you grab a wheel that's off the ground and give it a good shake, and if it has any movement at all, you got a bad bearing. So um, yeah, we're good to go. So I think uh, we'll go ahead and wrap up this video and. Uh, get the truck off the jack and uh, head down the road so anyways I hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did please give it a like uh, if you uh, made it this far into the video you probably enjoyed it so consider subscribing if you're not and I'll catch you guys again outside <laughs>